channel homemaking with Katrina so today is a, a grocery haul for a week two weeks give or take um, I never do a monthly grocery haul because it just does not work for my family um, if you are new to my channel and if you are old you see how I buy groceries and I like to buy from um, a week to two weeks to a month and I did share with you guys that we started going to a restaurant um, store. If you own a business or that involves food related things, um, then of course you can do that. I'm not like, a, I don't own a food business, but my husband has a business through the state that services um, equipment. And so that's what, that's why how we are able to go to that store and shop. And then of course it just works out good for us. Um, I wish I could say it's for a homeschool, but it's not. They don't, that doesn't count. Um, but yes, so we'll buy large quantities of things and that will last us a month or two. And that consists of just mainly meats um, because that's what lasts longer. You're able to store meat, of course, in a freezer that'll keep, you know, for six months to a year. It's no longer than that. Um, and it don't last like that from here. I think we're still, we've got like three or four bags of, two bags, maybe one bag of breast, I have to check, um, and some boneless, skinless thighs, and that'll be the end of that. And we were gonna go today and buy some more, but they closed early. We did last night get off, um, come back home from our week trip into Dallas, Texas. Um, we took a trip last year and we just, we love that area and it's just so much stuff that you can do in the state of Texas, plus just, we just love Texas. We had a wonderful, wonderful time. So we are back and of course, I made sure that my refrigerator was empty and cleaned out um, before I left so nothing would go bad, nothing would, you know, just get wasted. So I could do a grocery haul on Sunday. We got back last night about 10.30. We drove straight 17 and a half hours um, and got back home. So we didn't go to church this morning because we were exhausted. So we decided once we got up and got out and out, um, I had to go order a birthday cake for one of my children because tomorrow's her birthday. And I had to do some grocery shopping because school starts back tomorrow. Well, Tuesday, not tomorrow. Tuesday, bright and early. Well, when we get started, we usually, we typically start around 9, 9.30. Um, so, but yeah, so break is over, back to school, so we've got to have food for three meals, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So I'm going to show you guys where I went. Um, I went to Sam's Club and Target. Oh, and yeah. I was Harris Teeter. Uh, Harris Teeter was just a few things, and I'll show you this, the, the things that I did get, but most of everything came from Sam's Club and Target. So, yes. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like, and share. And of course, let's get started. So it is bright, y'all. That sun is out bright, so just bear with me. I'm gonna try to show things kind of close so you can see. So I'm gonna start on this end with my veggies and work my way down. Everything, I tried to organize it as best as possible, but I will just go through and show you things and then I'll tell you as I'm showing you the things where I got them from. So if you are interested in getting these items, I want you to know where you can go to get them. So starting right here, these are, I always get these. These are tomato on a, tomatoes on a vine. Um, they stay fresh for at least two weeks in the refrigerator they just and you just keep them on the vine that's what keeps them fresh they do not wither up and they work so well for my family um, these came from Sam's Club I got of course we always buy cucumbers because my kids like cucumbers as a snack and we have them on salads and I make homemade tzatziki sauce when I do like Greek food so I'm able to make multiple dishes with these cucumbers. These came from Sam's Club. Of course, we got some more rusted potatoes. Sam's Club, I got a humongous bag of spinach. Um, these are, I'm gonna use these for a couple of dishes. Got two bags of the Caesar salad kits. I usually make my own um, Caesar setup, but I add tomatoes to it and then, um, but I'm gonna probably use the Parmesan cheese, I don't know. Usually it's not enough for us. We like a lot of cheese in our salad. So two bags of the Caesar salad kits. I got some baby broccoli. This is really good. Got two of those. 
Got some of these little little potato um, company. They are so good. You just roast them off. And I've seen a lot of people where they will boil them and then get uh, the back of a cup and smash them down and then just kind of crisp them up. I'm going to try that. I think they'll be really, really good. Um, got some of those. Got some nectarines. Got some of these sweet, delicious plums. And that is it for the fruit on this side. Got um, some light brown sugar. Got, of course, some granulated sugar. Just to stock up, I have a big, humongous, huge, like 20 or 30 pound bag in, in the pantry. I just want it to stock up just to keep this um, up. Okay, now over here, I got butter. This came from Sam's Club. I'm showing you pretty much all the things that came from Sam's Club first then we can go from there. Um, I always buy this unsalted butter. It comes with four pounds um, in each container. Um, of course, I got my sour cream, a two pack of sour cream. Got a thing of half and half for my coffee, um, for me and my husband's coffee. Let me change that. I got, I always get this um, Shaved Asiago Parmesan and um, Romano cheese. So good. So, so good. You can use it for a lot of dishes. Got some of these cinnamon rolls. My kids love those for breakfast. And it's the four pack. I got this huge thing of chocolate chip cookies because we, I'm always buying, running to Dollar General to get chocolate chip cookies ever as an afternoon snack to make for the kids. And then ice cream, I usually make ice cream sandwiches. So what I'll do is I'll bake the cookies and um, fill them with vanilla ice cream or strawberry ice cream and they love them. So bought that. Over here got some case of, a box of goldfish and a case of variety chips. I bought these last time and maybe the time before and they taste just like Lay's. So it's a win because all the chips that's on here, um, those are the chips that my family like to eat. So all those extra like corn chips and they do like Doritos, but mainly the barbecue, the plain, the sour cream, the cheddar, the classic, the wavy, such, such good buy. And it comes with um, 42 for $13 and something, way cheaper than um, the ones that you purchase at Walmart or Target. I'm gonna slide through here, you got. Sorry, I'm trying to move the high chair out of the way. Um, got got this Nature's Own bread. Love to get that. Um, it is a two pack. Such a good deal because when I'm making um, breakfast or sandwiches for the kids, it always takes one loaf to make ten sandwiches. And some kids always ask for an extra sandwich. So, got this Thomas bagels two pack. Either I buy the plain or the blueberry, but they only had the plain and I was fine with it because I buy flavored cream cheese. And so, Sam's Club. We have, we love these barbecue baked beans with the um, beef brisket, so good. It tastes like restaurant style. It comes in a small container, but it is enough to feed my family. So it comes out, usually when I do baked beans, I do like the two cans of the, um, the large two cans, not the huge cans, but the two large, or medium sized cans. I buy two of those and it comes out to be about the same amount as um, this container. And this is a two pound, so yeah, more than a plenty. And then I always have other sides and meat with it. So it's so good. You can taste the beef brisket. You don't have to add any barbecue sauce, any salt, pepper, garlic. You don't have to add anything to it. The beans are just warm them up and serve them, so good. Bought some honey roasted turkey for sandwiches. Got some of this naan bread. Um, this will be either for pizzas. Um, one day it comes with 10, so I'm able to make the kids lunch. And, and also, sometimes I eat the lunch that they have, and then sometimes I don't. I may make something else for myself, or it just all depends on how I'm feeling that day after being busy doing everything else. Um, or I may just cut these up, and then we I serve them warm, and we have them with... Um, our Mediterranean meal, like um, chicken sabatia or, um, yeah, 
or we may do like grilled steak or something like that. So yeah, so that is Sam's Club. Got a case of ginger ales. Um, got some ground turkey. This is a two pack. One pack feeds my family. So I've got these. This makes two meals and it was 20 bucks. So definitely a good buy. This was from Sam's Club as well. I love ground chicken. I like to make um, meatballs with um, the ground chicken. I know it's turned upside down. That's better. <laughs> ground chicken, got this from Sam's Club as well. They had the two packs of whole fryers. Got some of those. Um, got a lamb leg, and I got two lamb chops. The lamb chops are for, for Easter dinner. I all, Every year I always make lamb for Easter with other vegetables. Mm -hmm. And then this is just gonna be for another meal one night. Roast it off and just shave it and do like, um, euros or whatever got um um what else did i get that is all from sam's club yes that is all from sam's club i end up spending 327 or something like that around that i can't remember the exact i know it was three um something it was a lot for what little i have but everything is expensive now so it is what it is um we bought a case of waters as well um and we've already i think we had one that was busted so that's why that's open um and then of course we always get our mind don't mind that hole when you have little skaters they ended up in put a hole in my wall so now we've got to repair that um and we always buy paper towels from um sam's club so that is all from sam's club now i'm going to move on to hair's teether because i'm right here at the at the um food I bought two packs of boneless skinless breast, two packs of leg quarters, um, two packs of steak, um, New York strips, and um, ribeyes. So that is all I bought, and I think I bought some croutons, some barbecue sauce, um, some Duke's mayo, Worcestershire sauce, and that is it. Oh, and some cheese. I love getting their cheese. They have, I love when they have this sale. They usually do it around holiday time. The two holidays that always stand out were three. I'm gonna say three. That would be Easter, Thanksgiving, and Christmas. So if you don't have a Harris Teeter in your area, I would check Kroger, because a lot of places that have Kroger, like my parents, they're in Georgia, and Georgia have Kroger's, they don't have Harris Teeter. But there may be like another store that owns them that runs the same special, but I have to have a lot of cheese anyway. Um, because we have so many people in the house and if I'm making like salad or if I'm making a pasta dish or if I'm making, you know, whatever that consists of cheese, I never can just have one bag of cheese. Even with my mac and cheese, I make like multiple, I have to have multiple bags of cheese. So long story short, because I just keep going on about the cheese, they have the buy two, get three free. So I love when they have that sale because you pay like six dollars for five bags of cheese when usually they're three dollars a bag any other day of the week so i love that so easter thanksgiving and christmas is when they typically run that sale they may do it another time but for the most part that's when they do it so i got two of um sharp white cheddar and then three of the italian um thick and it comes with um smoked provolone and mozzarella Okay, and that is it for Harris Teeter. Now on to Target. Target, I got Chobani Greek yogurt, two things of this one pound sharp cheddar, white sharp cheddar. Um, got four bags of the of regular cheese. I know you're like, what in the world? But I'm telling you, when I buy stuff, I'm not buying it to, I may use three bags of cheese in one meal. And so I want to have enough cheese where I'm not running back to the store. That's my goal. I like a lot of cheese, just like I like eggs and meat. Those are the three things that I need. Oh, and butter. Got to have butter or olive oil. Those are the, the essentials that I do not want to have to run back to the store and get, and they cost the most money. So always stock up on your cheese. So I got two sharp cheddar and two triple cheddar, and it's just a blend of cheese. This came from Target. Um, oh, and I also from Harris Teeter bought some small um, curd cottage cheese because I'm going to do a lasagna. 
Yes, you can have it. <laughs> Y'all, I got one child that's asking me for candy. Um, got some strawberry cream cheese. Oh, did I show you guys this? I got this also from Sam's Club. This is good for sandwiches. And it also melts really well if you, you know, are out of cheese. You can dice it up and it, it tastes the same because I've done that. Um, cream cheese, whipped, and strawberry. Got some vanilla um, yogurt. They... I guess Sunday is a day that a lot of people like to shop. Um, it just all depends. If we would have been in town, I probably would have done my shopping Friday or Saturday because I typically do shopping on Saturday, but we were out of town, so that's why. Um, that is why I just grabbed what they had, strawberry and then this honey vanilla, or vanilla honey, Greek yogurt. I got two gallons of whole milk. And then I got 1% organic and some lactose free because I can have ice cream, I can have coffee, um, butter, I can have some cheeses, but milk I can never have because it always messes my stomach up so bad with me um, having some stomach issues. So I'm going to try this and see how it works. And if it's good, then I at least have two because what I like about this is the dates don't expire as quick as the jug milk. Like this is four eight and this is five twenty seven. <laughs> so and this is the end of um, of April. So I've got time to to do that. And I like oat milk as well too. That's another one that I like to to drink as well. I got two um, cartons of eggs and I have some eggs as well left I bought a big thing of lemonade mix lime juice lemon juice um, bought some of this I love this grenadine because you just add it to lemonades and it gives it so much flavor oh I'm dropping stuff um, two boxes of cereal some honey O's and some frosted flakes and then some of these little generic um, fruity pebbles but these are dino fruity dino bites and the bag closes up good and it was like the same price as the brand name yeah um bart bought barbecue sauce what else excuse me boys excuse me my little helpers are ready to devour stuff you guys bought two things of diced tomatoes bought two things of tomato sauce this five cheese and um tomato and basil got some uh, um, italian breadcrumbs got some orzo pasta for a dish got some lasagna noodles i got a cantaloupe got some maple syrup or not really maple syrup but imitation maple syrup um got some kiwi got some grapes got two things of strawberries they were on sale that's why I got to check because I was going to buy spend $7.99 for this same size at Sam's Club and Target had if you spend $50 or more you get $10 off on on food um, products Joshua put that down please sir on food products and then um, they they were $7.99 but they had them marked down to $4.99 so of course I got them you know got two um two two is it two pound bag yes two two pound containers of strawberries and they smell so good like they smell sweet so and i know i've seen somebody um they were showing that you know i know here strawberry season doesn't start until late april so but it's coming because here we are we're in the end of the end of the month all week this is the last week in March so before we know it we'll be going to pick strawberries so yeah um got a whole bunch of candy because you know of course Easter is coming and I love candy anyway got three things of juice mainly for Miss Miracle for her little sippy cup out of all my babies she's my only one that does not require like a nighttime cup or wake up in the middle of the night to drink or anything and I'm so thankful for that but I like to keep her juice because when she's wants her juice she has to have her juice um and then the kids can have some too as well i got this um little three pack of capri suns um 
they had Target had buy three get 40% off so I got a Minute Maid I got a Coke a Dr. Pepper and then they have this new I love Izzy um, they have this new flavor sparkling pineapple so that sounds good to me and then I bought of course for some breakfast drinks um, some Sunny D so yeah so that is a grocery haul a large family grocery haul week to week give or take some things will last longer um, for my large family of 11 I'm just gonna give you guys an overview of everything and yeah So yes, so I hope you guys enjoyed this grocery haul. I know it was a little chattier today, but sometimes that's how it is. Um, I'm just thankful that I was able to buy some, especially coming off of vacation, having to restock. <sighs> yeah, so I'll give you guys a life update. I know that I just kind of went MIA for a little bit, but like I said on my last vlog, I think it was um, that I just took like a two week break because I've been dealing with my foot and just life and school and trying to prepare for this trip. Um, it was just a lot, and so I just really needed time to just kind of focus on the things that were way more important. And not that recording is not important, but sometimes picking up a camera. It takes a lot of effort, y'all. It does. And I appreciate y'all coming and watching um, week after week. I thank you guys so much for being so supportive. I really appreciate that. And I'm going to let you guys go, but I wish the best for you this week. And happy Easter. And I will see you guys next video. Bye.